I want to show you a little bit about the navigation pane over here on the left hand side. Notice how we have the clients table and the task table underneath of that. And if we had other tables, they'd be listed there as well. So uh, if you follow my mouse, if you click on this arrow pointing to the left, then you can put the navigation pane away or hide it temporarily. And then if you click on the right arrow, it brings it back, as we can see. Now, if you want to change what's going to display in the navigation pane, we can click on the pull down over here. And then it gives you some different options. I actually like to see it by object type, and this is what I'm used to. So if I pick on object type, then notice I have all of the tables together, and then below that would have the queries and forums. And that kind of makes, makes it look like it, it, it's looked in the previous versions. So I do like that. That's the way I use that. Um, but what we were looking at was uh, tables and related views. So let's go back there for a second, and then it shows you the tables this way. In this case, I can sort them by created date, right? And then the old, the uh, older ones are first, and the new ones. Uh, I can um, sort it by the modified date. I can just look at the ones uh, for today only. All right, so you can see different views of your uh, of your information here. In this case, we're going to say tables and related views. Now it's back to the way it was before. Where even here, I can just look at the clients table. Yeah, so you can get very specific here. So I actually like to see this by object type. And then once I do that, then um, we can look at it by created date, modified date, filtered by group. Uh, then we can just look, just look at the tables, just look at the queries, just look at the forms, or just look at the reports. I usually will look at all access objects, but you can certainly limit it to just those, uh, those different types of objects. Okay, so that's a little bit about using your navigation pane here in um, Microsoft Access 2007. If you want it to be similar to the way it looked in previous versions, you're going to pick on object type. That way all the tables, queries, forms, and reports will be, will be grouped together.